What, what's wrong? Explain yourself. What, what do you mean? You, you think it's fucking funny, dude? I don't want to be around these fucking losers. And you should probably conduct yourself a little bit better. Yeah, what do you mean, damn, bro? What, what the f do you mean, damn? What do you mean, damn? What the f do you mean, damn? Why do you no, do that? Oh, that's that? that. He said he's going to wear his skin like a suit. I love that it cut off at, yeah, I know, I know what happens next, okay? I know, I know. I, know. I love that it cut off at that exact moment. Thank All right, thank uh, you. Are we ever going to accept Sam Hyde's fight offer? What? I don't, dude, no. Why, why are you fucking talking to me with some dumbass fucking weirdo Nazi? What's wrong with you? What, what's wrong? Explain yourself. What, what, do, what do you mean? You, you think it's fucking funny, dude? Someone you got some you fucking out weird, out, you got some weird fucking deadbeat loser comedian. Yeah. Who has completely fucking lost all of its importance on the world by fucking himself over, by giving Andrew Anglin five thousand dollars in his fucking Nazi defense fund? Oh my fund. god! And you're gonna oh, come man. to me and be like, yeah, "It's so funny." Yeah, it's not funny, is it? Do you like that? Do you think it's funny? Oh my god! I think it's funny. Go ahead. Explain. Yeah. How is he so fucking tilted off this? This look at this. Look at this guy. Look. He just, he just, he's such a regular dude, and his son's so fucking mad about it. Jesus, man! Imagine getting mad at this guy. What do you think it's funny? I, I think would it's like funny. to Go see ahead. the fight between explain. you two. Yeah, there's no explaining. I don't want to be around these fucking losers, and you should probably conduct yourself a little bit better. Oh my god, he sounds like he's fucking telling them off. No, whoop his fucking! I would never. All right. There's a longer version. What do we miss? Has he got the M word in? <laughs> no way! No way! <laughs> Look at this scene! <laughs> That's so good! That's so good. That's so funny, man. That's a fucking banger. Okay, what's this one? Oh, I want to give you respect for that. Oh, thank you. Man. And uh, I have another question. Uh, I think Sam Hyde he called you out on like a boxing event. Yeah. Are you interested in like the boxing scene or not? No. Really I, I, yeah. I don't know why you guys are so into this shit. He's a Nazi. Like, I don't know. What's happening right now? It's so whack, bro. Like, the, I, the, this is, by the way, Sam Hyde isn't a fucking Nazi, okay? Sam Hyde's like a provocateur comedian. Like, he's not a fucking Nazi. Like, what the fuck? I just, I don't understand why all you motherfuckers have to, like, run around with this shit. What's going on? What's going on? Nothing. Get the fuck out of my face, bro. You fucking oh. asshole. Yeah, what do you mean, damn, bro? Is, what but, what the know. fuck do you mean, damn? What do you mean, damn? Okay, yeah, no worries. I'm gonna stream for like another hour and a half or so. What do you mean, damn? Why do you no, do I'm, this? I'm shit? asking questions. I don't know. You're not asking to make questions. All right, bro. Yo, chill, bro. Get the fuck out of here. You guys are fine. Pussy. That's bad. That was that guy. Wait, sorry, what was that? I missed that. Fuck. I don't know why you guys are so into this shit. He's a Nazi. Like, I don't know. What? What's happening right now? It's so whack, bro. Like, I, I just, I don't understand why all you motherfuckers have to like run around with this shit. What's going on? What's going on? Nothing. Get the fuck out of my face, bro. You fucking asshole. Yeah. What do you mean, damn, bro? What, what the fuck do you mean, damn? What do you mean, damn? What the fuck do you mean, damn? Why do you do that? I don't know. You're not asking. Alright, bro. Yo, chill, bro. What's in the corner store? Oh, some sugar free energy drinks. If there's any sugar free energy drinks, I'll be up for that, okay? Get the fuck out of here. Pussy. That was whack. Fuck that guy. Fuck your mom. <laughs> oh, I want to give you respect for that. Oh, thank you, man. Yeah. I just. <laughs> What's the best way to deal with that? I, I just, I feel like going that mad. I, I don't know, man. I, 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 what's the best way to deal with that? Honestly. Yeah, that, 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 I think that's a good point, right? I think, 
Like, some of these people just think it's a funny meme, right? I mean, I don't know, man. Like, <laughs> right, guys, okay, listen. Can we just say something here, okay? Right? Can we just say something here, right? I know that Sam Hyder is doing a character, but he was, it was like, it was pretty fucking schizo what he said, right? He said he was going to wear... <laughs> I disavow. It's a, it's bad. I disavow. He said he's gonna wear his skin like a suit. He said he's gonna wear his skin like a fucking suit. Like that's like fuck me. That is, oh, that is a spicy meme. Jesus. <laughs> that could have meant anything though. What about when he said he was gonna kill him? What do you, what do you think that meant? That was the candy man talking. Jesus Christ. That's so fucking whack, dude. Yeah. That's pretty crazy. All right. I sprayed him. I was like, hey, you want a reaction? Here you go. I fucking sprayed him in the face. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What the fuck are you looking at, bro? You want to get kicked out? Is that what you want? Is that what? You want a reaction? No. You want to get kicked out? I just asked you a question. All right, we're walking away, chat. I know this is juicy content, but I'm not gonna feed it. I'm walking away. I love the fact that he's like doing the tough guy thing, but as tough guy as in, I can get you kicked out. <laughs> I don't know, man. That's a bit cringe. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm gonna speak to security, and they're gonna they're gonna take you out. You know what I mean? It's like it's like it's like um. Like it's something like it's something like uh, some some wealthy fucker would do in a club or something, you know. I know the manager, and if you keep talking to me, I'm going to get you kicked out. I don't know. Kind of cringe. But look, I've got some sympathy, honestly. You know, obviously, I understand it's shitty if people are coming up to you and like poking you about this thing that you're pissed off about or concerned about, right? However, I think he's just responding in the worst possible way. And he's just and he's just fueling it, right? He's just absolutely fueling it. What's this? Who it is? Hassan Piker. That's it. <laughs> oh my God! Circus it's all right, bro. Bro, <laughs> this guy, bro. This guy looks so. His mood was spoiled. <laughs> <No. laughs> just saying hi to an old friend. Sheesh. I feel like Alex Jones. <laughs> That's crazy, man. That's crazy. <laughs> he, well, I mean, I don't know, man. He was getting recorded. But I don't fucking know. <laughs> you think it's because he's fucking Zerk as a big boy? Is that what you're saying? I gotta ask you, will you ever be in another debate with Destiny ever again? No, I see no reason to. Really? Yeah. You guys are like past each other, yeah. Think of the bits. No, I just don't. I don't. I don't, uh, I don't see a reason. I just pause this. Not film him when he's acting unhinged. Run interference for my man child friend. Wait, so hang on. So Hassan had a cameraman. Is that right? And the cameraman was like putting it in certain directions when like it was looking a bit embarrassing. I'm very particular about who I debate. We've been very open about it. I uh, will debate. People that are uh, people that have a large presence, people that I think are doing harmful content, that have a large enough presence that you know someone like Andrew Tate that is like uh, adequate for someone to be like, all right, I'm not platforming this person, I'm going to criticize this person, uh, I'm going to you know I'm going to address some of the things that they're saying. But ultimately, I think debates are pseudo intellectual sparring. It's like WWE for nerds. It's blood sport. Rhetoric is king. You would consider yourself pretty good at it, though, right? No. No? No, not at all. I'm very open about I don't know if you watch my streams at all, but I don't think I'm that great of a, I don't think I'm that great of a debater. I have debated many great debaters or people that call themselves great debaters. So even though you don't... And it's up to interpretation. Even though you don't, you would never, uh, like, anytime soon. Can you can you say that Gatsby is a great debater or not? I don't... The <laughs> DGG Rod says... Notice how the moment like, the guy mentioned Destiny, he starts unpacking a fresh nicotine gum. <laughs> he said he needs a nicotine it because he's so stressed. I think being a good debater is necessarily a good quality. Well, okay, it's not a good quality. I, I think like, but can you say I, I care more about integrity uh, than, and having a moral compass. Stop pausing. Okay, because you said that, I've decided to pause again. And I'm going to tell you why that's so fucking annoying, okay? 
It's annoying because part of this is pausing to make a comment about what you see in front of you, all right? That's part of the stream dynamic. That's what happens, okay? I understand there's other streamers out there, right, that sit there playing fucking Autismo Simulator 2, right, half listening to a video and sometimes interjecting, right? But half of those interjections are going, oh, how do I get more fucking aluminium, alu aluminium? How do I get more aluminium factories or some shit like that, right? That's not what we do here, okay? That's not what we fucking do here, right? If you don't like it, fuck off. Uh, and, and genuinely caring about other people and marginalized communities and like pushing an em pushing empathy for his politics. Uh, and I think that uh, debate lording specifically for blood sport, specifically for uh, the, the uh, virtue, yeah. or making it seem like it's a virtuous thing or a good thing, is ultimately not my vibe at all. Got it. Um, specifically because I, I care about the things that I talk about. To, to a degree that makes me actually a bad debater because I get emotional, I get passionate. That might actually, you know, track well with people that are like, that guy's authentic, I like what he's saying. But in the debate sphere, you've lost. The moment that you've lost your cool, you've lost the debate. And I think people are very, people that are very good at debating are usually very good at debating because they have no stake. They have no emotional investment. They have no empathetic investment in the marginalized communities that they speak out against or speak out for. Um, and they they can keep their composure. And I think that's, uh, you know, that's the reason why they, you see so many of them switch positions. You see so many of them uh, argue on either side of the argument. I mean, um, that's that's my take on it. I hope that was, uh, that was good for you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you as well. It's just basically like I, I feel like I feel like all the takes about Asan have been given already. Like everyone knows what he's all about, right? He's like just this this clout obsessed guy who will do whatever is necessary at the time to get where he needs to be. And so debates for him were literally just a means to an end. You know, it was a way to get clout. It was a way to you know bring audience people in, whatever. Da 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 da. da you know. Um, so, you know, it's funny how he talks about having no investment in it when his only investment in debates has ever been to increase the amount of clout and attention that he's getting. And, you know, that's it, really. That's my perspective on it, anyway. I don't know. I just, yeah. And and the stuff with the, the Sam Hyde thing, like... Wasn't he just, like... Why don't he just say No. And then move on. <clears throat> I think his problem is he's so easy to wind up. But yeah, there we go. There's the Hassan memes, I guess. <laughs>